this is Chad with PC Works Plus. Today I'll be showing you how to reduce the size of your Outlook Exchange mailbox. This will help ensure you don't receive delivery restriction messages that are caused by having a mailbox that is over the default size limit and is normally set by your network administrator. When looking at your Outlook window you'll see several options on the pane located on the left side of the screen. This is your mailbox and includes your inbox, sent items, deleted items, and any other folders you've created. The first step we can take to decreasing your mailbox size is click on the deleted items folder. Items that are deleted from the inbox or sent items folder get sent to this folder. They are not permanently deleted until they are deleted again from this folder. You can do this by right clicking on a message choosing delete. Notice it asks you if you're sure you want to permanently delete this message. Also note if you have a large amount of messages, holding the control button and pressing A will select all messages. Then you can again right click and choose delete and it will delete all messages permanently. The second method you can use to decrease your mailbox size is to sort your inbox by size and date to determine which messages you may no longer need. Do this by right clicking on the top of the message list where it says arranged by. From this menu you have several options to choose from. The most useful in this case are arranged by date, size, and attachments. This will list items in order of emails that have attachments on top from oldest to newest and from largest to smallest respectively. Remember, if you delete any items using this method, you must also delete them from the deleted items folder in order to decrease your mailbox size. The third method you can use to decrease your mailbox size is to click on the plus sign next to the search folders. Then choose large mail, and this will show you large mail larger than 100 KB from every folder that is in your mailbox. Remember again if you delete items from here you must also permanently delete them by deleting them out of your deleted items folder. Remember decreasing your mailbox size will help prevent you from receiving warning messages. It also keeps you safe from reaching limits that many policies enforce that will eventually prohibit you from sending or receiving mail when your mailbox has surpassed the size limit.